Luckily, it's nice and sunny out today, but Brandon, you say there could be storms later this week, right? That's right, Corey, but we've been so blessed this weekend. Wonderful weather to enjoy and temperatures easily into the 80s. But yes, by Wednesday and Thursday, a chance for showers and thunderstorms coming back in. Now Thursday, some of the storms could be strong to severe, but for the time being, we have those warm temperatures continuing over the next few days. Those highs easily into the 80s. And then again, that change coming up for the middle part of the week. We'll time it out on future track coming up. Your current temperature now at the Tulsa Airport at 84 degrees. The dew point eh, not doing too bad. If it was into the 60s, well, that would be another story. But now at 56 degrees, southeasterly winds between about 10 and 20 miles per hour. On the hot camera, you can see the baby chick is taking a nap. A nice hour to do so, I would say. Winona now at 84 degrees. We have Old Mogi at 83. Also into the lower 80s around McAllister and 84 around Salisaw and also in Stigler here at the 5 o'clock hour. The official daytime high today was a warm one at 86 degrees. The average high temperature for this time of year comes in at 77 and the record for the date is actually into the 90s at 93 set all the way back from 1918. Well, you can see still this blocking pattern right over the state of Oklahoma, protecting us from any weather systems trying to come in from the west. And it's even raining today in throughout Southern California in Los Angeles. So I guess we'll take the dry weather for the time being. You can see that heat building up across the central part of the United States. Look at South Dakota now at 91 degrees, Omaha at 83 and easily into the 80s to close to 90 degrees for our friends in Texas, including Dallas now at 87. So about the same as what we experienced here in green country. Timing things out on future tracks. So yes, dry weather tomorrow and also on Tuesday, but then Wednesday starting out in the morning Morning. You can see the clock right there, an increasing chance for those showers and some isolated thunderstorms. Yes, we're probably going to see some wet weather in places on Wednesday, but more widespread showers and potentially stronger thunderstorms on the way for your Thursday on your extended forecast. But all things quiet out there overnight tonight with those lows a little bit milder from the upper 50s to right around 60 degrees. Look at prior at 58, 59 in Claremore. South winds continuing between about 5 and 10. Totally clear skies out there tonight. Sepulpa falls only off to about 59, 58 in Oak Mulgee. South winds all less than about 10 miles per hour. Another wonderful night across eastern Oklahoma with those overnight lows from the upper 50s to right around 60 degrees. So yes, sunshine for tomorrow morning. It's going to be warm out there to start out the day at 63 degrees. Lunchtime right at 80 degrees just like today and jumping up into the mid 80s for mid to late afternoon. Sunshine continuing tomorrow in Bartlesville at 84 degrees. We have Talala also pushing up into the mid 80 south winds increasing a bit by the afternoon between about 10 and 15 miles per hour. Mostly sunny skies. McAllister at 85 degrees and also into the mid 80s around Holdenville and also up towards the north around Henrietta. Fine looking start to the week for sure. Here's a look at your latest seven day forecast about the same for Tuesday. Some more increasing clouds out there in advance of our next system. As I showed you on future track for Wednesday, a chance for showers and thunderstorms. A better chance for more widespread showers and thunderstorms on Thursday. Some could be strong to severe and eventually cooling back those highs into the 70s.